Easter Jeep Safari really has evolved into a very, very family-oriented trail. It's the opportunity for families to get out to enjoy their Jeep vehicle in a safe, mildly controlled circumstance where they can realistically use their vehicle to its full potential. We had kids today that were four or five years old. We had a guy that just drove through the escalator that was probably in his late 70s. And, and it's just an incredible opportunity to, to be with people that are so passionate about this sport. I was diagnosed when I was six. It's a form of muscular dystrophy, and so it makes it hard for me to, to be able to walk long distances. It has progressively gotten worse, but these days, about 100 yards is about all I can do. And so, I mean, it's great that having these friends that will take me out, that'll literally lift me into my Jeep, you know, so I can go out and I can drive, and I can do these type of things. For me, it's, it's the opportunity to go out and to do a sport where I can compete with quote unquote normal people. As a spotter, I think it's very important to make sure that people feel the confidence that you have, because you can see their vehicle, you can see what it's doing, you can see the way their tires are grabbing. Are they gonna hit a bump? Are they gonna hit a rock? They need to give it more gas, less gas, turn driver, passenger. But I think a lot of it is just giving that ability to be able to inspire confidence so that they know they're in control of what's happening. And that their vehicle's okay, they're gonna make it. I always jokingly say, but half serious, if you feel like you're gonna roll over, you're on the right line. You know, I'm driving the vehicle, but I'm doing it vicariously through the, through the actual person that's in the car. And on a trail like this, when these people have driven hundreds if not thousands of miles to come to Moab, especially for this trail, I want to give them every opportunity they can to say, you know what, I drove it. For the rest of their life, regardless of what happens, they can always look back on today and say, you know what, I drove that obstacle. I made it out under my own power. And that, I think, says a lot for a lot of these people.